internet, it's Jessica, and welcome to another reaction video. I am so excited. This is for Bayonetta 3. It is the official release date trailer, which I have been waiting for for the longest time. Because I kept thinking, there's no Bayonetta 3 release date. <laughs> but I'm finally excited to see it and finally to, when to know when it's coming out. I can't even talk properly because I'm too excited. Anyway, let's look at the trailer. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm so excited. I love this game so much. More new faces, I see. <laughs> this is not- I know this is not Bayonetta, it's Ceresa. I, it has to be. This can't be actually her. It's little Ceresa. All grown up. Cause her outfit is so different. Look at her! Damn! He's got a new outfit, I think. <laughs> Everyone does. Oh my god. Everyone does look different. I love it! The design is so cool! Ooh! Trinity in a snap. Oh my god. Thank you, Professor. <laughs> She's so hot. I love her. Eyes, I think you'd be a bit more perceptive. I can't wait to play this. It looks so much fun, like the gameplay. I believe you two have already met. Wait. Let's go. This world is wait. my protection. What? <laughs> Okay, I'm confused now. They're homunculi. Man-made bioweapons. Oh, we're going bioweapons this time. Look, we don't have time. If we don't stop them, this world is history. Who's that? And reality as we know it gets wiped Virgil? out Virgil? Oh, damn. Whoa, okay, she's kind of hot too. What the heck? What do you expect us to do? I want you to find a scientist named Sigurd. He's somewhere in this world, and he can help us. Who's this? I like the music. Do you know a girl named Viola? She sent me to find you. I Is that Sean? I knew why you're here. You're looking for a way to be out of here. Have we met before? I think I'd remember you, right, girl? <laughs> oh, God, please. Someone seems very interested in our arrival. Is it him? I'm confused. Are they like their daughters? Even though it's technically not their daughters? You know what I'm saying? My name is Viola. Oh, Viola. Oh, okay, never mind. Interesting. Bayonetta 3! Oh my god! I'm so excited! When? Is this their daughter? Because, like, I know that this Bayonetta, I think it's kind of obvious. The Bayonetta that we're seeing in the trailers is not actually Bayonetta, like, actual Ceresa. It's younger Ceresa grown up. Original Bayonetta doesn't really wear stuff like that, but I don't know if it, I could be wrong. It could be actually her. It just seems like everything is, like, out of order. And then we have Viola, she's a new character. And I really thought it was like younger Jean or something like that, but I don't think so. I will say I like that we're getting like Madame Butterfly like coming out. She's got like, it seems like Bayonetta's got more moves this time around too. Like different, like look at this. This is so cool, I love that. I love that we're getting more of her uh, and more of different transformations of her too. I just want to say I love everyone's design. Like, Rodin's design is so good. Where's Luca? Same with Luca, too. Can I just say, I, I love Luca. I really do. He's an idiot and a very himbo energy. But, like, what is going on with your jacket, my guy? <laughs> what is going on with this? You, Riot Girl. But it seems like Luca knows Viola. 
so I'm kind of like wondering like what's the connection there that's why I thought it was just like younger versions of everybody you know what I mean but I don't know anymore this is why I'm confused even though in reality if you really think about it, it this is still Bayonetta it's just that how Bayonetta treated her younger self kind of helped her um become i guess become this character now but that's what i'm saying i don't know how different or how similar she's gonna be from the previous two bayonetta games all right so that's gonna be that i can't believe we finally have a release day you guys know that i'm gonna be playing this on my channel so don't worry you don't even have to ask me that question but i i'm more so interested in seeing like where the story's gonna go because obviously this is a continuation of the last two and like i said there's so much so many things happening and I feel like the time magic kind of has like something to do with it because I know obviously the the umber witches have that ability to control time and whatever it's in integrated in the gameplay so that's why I think it's like something to do with that but at the same time not really but it seems like the enemies this time are in real life because before it was only where the witches could see the enemies like the angels and stuff like that but now now it seems like everybody can see them and they're a bio weapon created so that's interesting and very different anyway i would like to hear from you guys please let me know in the comments what you think and if you want to check out my let's play for bayonetta 1 and 2 i'll leave a link in the description to the playlist so you can go ahead and watch that but yeah i can't wait to play it i'm so excited anyway if you guys enjoyed this video remember to leave a like thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so you know when i upload my let's play for bayonetta 3 thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one bye